Hello guys, Men's Graphics here. Hope you guys are okay. Hope you guys are getting ready for the Christmas season. So guys, I posted an image on my Instagram a few days ago and I saw that you guys were eager to learn how I achieved um, the effect that I used on that image. So today guys, I'll be showing you a quick tutorial on how to achieve this grunge effect on your background and also on your test. So without further ado guys, let's get started and let's start designing. So quick reminder guys, all the assets that I'll be using for this project will be found in the description below. So I'll be using uh, the custom size 2000 by 2000 pixels and uh, a 300 resolution RGB color mode and I'll be setting my background to black. So now I have my workspace here. I'll go to file, place embedded and I'll be placing the image that I'll be using for this project. I downloaded this image online. So I use my transform controls to expand this. Okay. Then I'll head over to filter. Camera raw filter. Okay, right now what I'll do on camera raw is that I'm going to increase the texture. And the clarity then I'll go over to the presets and I'll increase the sharpening I'll be using heavy then I'll click on OK so we have it here we have more texture and more clarity on the background so I'll duplicate these and I'll Convert it to a smart object and I'll name it um, main background. And then I'll duplicate it and um, I'll change the blend mode to multiply. And then I think I should rename this uh, multiply layer. So the next step now is uh, I'm going to uh, impute the test that I'll be using for this right uh, for the right up I'll be using for this design. Which is a make today count. This was originally uh, a post I made for my Instagram. And most of you guys really loved it and we are like um, needing a tutorial to actually know how to do something similar to this so I'll go to select all and I'll be changing the font for this I'll be using Akira Okay, I'll make sure this is aligned to the center. Then I'll use the character panel to work on the leading and the tracking. Okay, once I'm done with that. I'll use the transform controls to reduce it a little bit. Then I'll go to my layers panel and I'll actually rasterize the test. And then I'll make a selection of this, uh, the top part of the key right here. And I'll create a new layer from the selection by hitting Ctrl J and then Ctrl T and I'll take this to the top. So we now have this cool effect on the K. 
and then I'll select both of them and I'll convert it to a smart object. Okay, let me just name this quickly. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to duplicate the main background and I'll take it above the test layer. Then I'll create a clipping mask. Adjust it a little bit. And then I'll select the test and the main background to copy and convert both of them to a smart object. And then I think I'll go with test grunge for this uh, layer name. And then I'll duplicate it and I'll set the blend mode to screen. And I think I'll duplicate it a second time depending on how much you want the effect to look like. So for this I'm actually okay with this. So the next thing is I'm going to um, impute the second test for this uh, project which is a uh, okay I think I think I had another thing in mind here. So I'm using never relent. Then I'll be changing the font to autograph. Okay, let me just uh, autograph. And then I'll actually adjust this a little bit. Um, make sure it's aligned. Then I'll use um the transform controls to reduce the size a little bit okay I think uh, I'm okay with it so I'll just uh, take it up a little bit so guys this is it this is how I actually created this design now uh, as you can see it's very very easy it's very very uh, easy and um, very cool to replicate so guys if you actually want to try this out you can try this out and you can also um, use this to learn quite a few things so for the next aspect of this video which i may be dropping later in the week or by next year i'll be showing you how to create your own grunge background to actually um, ensure more flexibility so i'll be dropping a video on how you can create your own personal grunge uh, background so guys Thank you for staying to the end of this video. Make sure you like, comment, and share. And make sure you subscribe to the channel if you are new to this channel. So with that all said and done, Mess Graphics.